Hey Taurus, welcome. These messages for February 10th through February 17th, 2024. The energy around you and surrounding you for the week. What do you need to know or hear? You guys can follow me on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube. If you want to book a reading with me, you could do so through my Etsy. It's safe and secure. And be sure to follow because I do these weekly and I'll never DM you guys or solicit. All right, let's get into this reading for you. Wow, so you have the energy of strength around you, which I feel like you need it because I do feel like with this card coming up, this is like you've really been through a lot. I feel like some things you're on like an endless cycle with. Some things that um, in your life I feel like are things that you have to be mentally strong about. And this is you like withstanding all your challenges. So definitely pat yourself on the back. It's like amazing that you know, you're able to keep getting up and keep going and, and keeping strong uh, despite the difficulties. And I feel like some tragedies that you've seen and dealt with. And, you know, I feel like this is like you're a little bit in survival mode, though. So I do feel like just know that things are getting better. This is like going to be a turn for the better. This is like definitely be around those people that you feel can give you the support and nurture that you need like a supportive friend or family member somebody that you know you can go to that doesn't judge you somebody that you know warms your heart somebody that you know you you share a good bond with because that's the kind of people that are gonna continue to uplift you when you're in your darkest hours so um I just feel like your nature is very good. I feel like this is like you going to be attracting like a lot of good opportunities to yourself with people, meeting new people, um, you know, attracting like new energy to yourself. This could be like new connections, new business um, connections, a lot of really good energy for that. And, and you are strong. You have to know this. I feel like sometimes you feel like giving up or you feel like, you know, I just can't do this anymore or you don't want your emotions to get the better of you. Um, this could be too that, you know, maybe you've had some heartbreaks or heartache that you're still trying to heal from, but it's not quite healed all the way yet. You might still be thinking about this person or you might still be affected by this person's energy. So it could be that. It could also be that, you know, you maybe needed to just see or hear, not hear, you needed to see that you could go through these challenges and be okay and make it out okay. On the flip side, I feel like you might be dealing with somebody that's a little bit narcissistic. Um, someone who's kind of stubborn, childish, immature, bratty. They might be a bit showy, like, look at me. They could be, um, you know, entitled. They're not dealing with their demons. They're not dealing with that restless energy that they have. They might be treating people like they're per like you're supposed to be their punching bag that's what I feel like or they want to be the center of attention or they just have a lot of negative energy and they're very fixated right now and it's very exhausting I feel like you just have to set really really strong good boundaries and stick to them please because I feel like this person is too domineering and too controlling they have bad habits they're bossy they feel very defeated in life so you know this you can only do so much and you have to take care of you too you got to put your oxygen mask on first remember that Check back next week.